doing today. Darl were here and I am playing The Walking Dead number six on my stuff, but you know, episode three, because I just finished episode two. It says episode two there, but it's going two, three, you know, because it says long road ahead. So, yeah, I, I wonder who was that dude right there when I first saw this picture. But, no worries now, I know who they is. And, well, let me get out of here. Let me stop doing this. I'm going to talk when I got something to say about this game. So, yeah. Yeah, I'll just go here and talk. So, yeah, let me play this. This was happening on the last time. Let's see what's going on here. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I, I want, want to know, know why you thought bringing more mouths was a good, good idea. idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my camp. Oh, damn, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Yep, we do. And it's got the right of dairy. As long as they keep getting food from there, you'll be safe. So we fucked up then. By killing those people at the dairy now, they go go after us. And she's dead too. But at a dairy, all that food not necessary because the dairy is supposed to be for milk and stuff. This game says adapt to the choices that you make. The story is tolerated on something. I ain't read the rest of it. Tall Tale Games presents The Walking uh, and Association uh, Extra Stuff. The Walking Dead. Long Road Ahead, Episode 3. Looks like this is our lucky day. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. Mm-hmm. Where do you come down on staying or going? You mean, packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it, but you made up your mind yet? We should stay, we should go. We should go. Motels run its course, and it's not safe. You're damn right it has. We pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water. And if Lily's dead set on staying, then, well, that's the way it goes. A plane landed in the 9 11 again! Okay, just like last. <coughs> Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got on her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. What happened to the gun that he was holding? Looks like she's had 
What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. Come on. Ah, shit. Damn it. I can't reach. Sorry, pal. All right, stay put. There's no safe way through that mess. Unless you want to die. All right. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I noticed that. He's not doing so good, huh? Kill it down on. Uh. She'll be fine. Mm -hmm. You really think so? I don't know, man. I've been thinking, and huh, I just don't know. Look at the tire. It's completely flat. The girl's still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon. I hope not. I hope not. She'll get there. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Still, yeah. it, it was a scary, scary situation, situation for him. Sean died situation, I mean. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Are you okay? Jesus. Are you okay? okay? I'm fine. Shit. I'm sorry, pal. I thought it'd be healed up better. You're lucky it wasn't any worse. You could have. Yep, yep. Leave her. Screaming, man. See, they ain't going away, so why you keep screaming? <coughs> we 
should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Hurry up, get stuff that's looking useful. There we go. And the last thing. Looking up, I don't see nothing else. What's the next one? She's gone. There's not much time now. Hurry up, take stuff, take stuff, take open it, open it, hurry up. Just get food that you can, man. Don't even think about it when there's something like this going on. Hurry up. Bandage. Get that. Get that stuff too. What's next? Same stuff. Same stuff. Oh, oh snap. Get that. And get that. Get it. Fuck. Incoming. Come on, Lee. Up and over. Help me, can I? Trying to think about it. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Huh. So, what did you get? A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you two, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the I'll wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health. But he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. I could be. I don't think you're it could capable. Be worse. Stop don't this start shit. with me, either. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lily. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. 
How has this not been working? We have we got all the protection we need. We got plenty of food and stations. We deal with this gun. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like we got what we needed. It was a mistake. She is dead anyway. Don't take that tone with him. It's the first smart thing he's done in a while. We got what we needed. It was just something that had to happen. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming this way. It's not going to be easy out on the road! How would you know? What, what I, I know? know? I know you're not, not above murder. murder. I, know I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. supplies. That's, That's right. right. Stealing! And, and I, I know, know the, the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. day. Now everybody, everybody get, get out. out. She get over it. She's right, you know. Shit's just getting worse by the day. Hey, and the achievement was right there in front of, in front of me and stuff. She's been through so much. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. <sighs> Things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. I can go in there. Wait. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? About the guns. We need to try harder with Lily. You guys trust anyone here? You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it given all that's happened. Mm-hmm. So what then? Time will come we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. About the guns. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. But we need them. There's no doubt about that. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Wait, what? There she go. That's what I was just looking for.
Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What you doing? What you doing What's there? What you working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubber. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Dang it, went to the wrong spot. But anyway, let's go. Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. I'm fine. Don't brood. I know you're fine. You're a convicted killer. God, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. Because you're a good man. You know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed. And telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let I'll people let know. People know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Try not to play stoic. It makes your forehead crinkle. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? What about me? Do you feel safe here? Have you any thoughts about Lily? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Mm-hmm. Okay. Do you have any thoughts about Lily? Do you uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Do you think people are ready to hear about me? Do you really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now, it doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? You have to chill out. You think? I'm not going to play the victim, but you and your buddy might have had a hand in my instability. Can I do anything for you? Have you? No. Yes. I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody. One of us. Out there. He or she or they have been taking things. You haven't really been sleeping. Don't start in on that. You've been through a trauma, and you're not taking care of yourself. It counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my eye on. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? 
I found this tossed into the garbage. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Seems like you're manufacturing this for nothing. Prove me wrong. Or I'll just assume it was you. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the grease detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. You can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. Secrecy. Did you hear what I just said? I won't tell a so. <laughs> the part of <laughs> It's kind of weird. You can't help. I will live in the shadows. <laughs> Wait. Okay. Hey, I gotta think back in the other episodes. Think about what happened. Oh. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> a flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and... Maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay, then. I still don't trust you. I'm just playing, but yeah. Hi, guys. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Uh, Catcha. Catch. Oh, that's her name. Catcha, can I talk to you for a second? Kenny, can I talk to you for a second? Um. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? It's serious. Oh, no. You see how they walk? Like, literally, like, he... I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's, different from everything. This was before the walkers. Uh, I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl. And, you know, I, I was worried. I just smashed the guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, right? Yeah, I did. And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess has got us doing now, Lee. Uh-huh. Yeah. Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course. Then shut it. You don't know anybody any kind of expert. Wait, what was that? Hold on. No, I'm I'm so I think I seen something red like go on top of one of these buildings like the one back here. It was like up there. It wasn't the light, it was something else. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. <clears throat> Go by this glass.
Doc. A clue. Me. What do you think it is? I thought I told you you couldn't help. I'm curious. You don't say. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do uh, oh, not you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst. Lee. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues. Yeah, and Duck, I got it. Good job. <laughs> Somebody was over here, too. I suppose I should go out there and look around. <laughs> stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Okay. Oh, I have to take a look outside like that. I thought I can close it back. So they won't get hurt if a walker comes in. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? We got our people out there! We ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second! Lily. What the hell are you- Stall him! What? Just keep him talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life! Shit. Enough of this bullshit! Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors! Yeah! Hold it, asshole! Take it easy. We have more supplies. We can keep the deal going. Too late, shithead! We ain't giving second chances. It, it was a mix-up. We'll make it worth your while. I'm listening. What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. And shut up, bro. Right. Oh, shit. Uh. Uh. Oh, my God, no. Get 
Stay there! Got him. Who's next? Pop that little head out of yours, man. Everybody can be okay. Gotcha. Hurry, come on! Clint, get inside the RV. It's gonna be okay. Go! I gotta really do this like this. Last chance, get down here. There we go. You're supposed to save all your. All the people you, you got. Okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm sorry. Everything's fine. Everything's better. not fine. We need to figure out how this happened. We just lost everything. Well, we're lucky as shit to have this RV. And nobody died. Cat's head is split up. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? Please. We have to get it out of you then. Back off. You are in no position to make demands. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just pointing fingers. I didn't just come up with this. I've had my suspicions. Holly's trustworthy. She's not a traitor, Lily. Thank you, Lee. She can fight her own battles. Unless there's something going on here that implicates you both. Don't be ridiculous. Like, look, maybe we should vote or something like that. Vote? What? Just look. Carly's a stand-up gal, and maybe this was all just a mistake. We need to look at the facts. Let's calm down, we'll eat, and we'll deal with it. Stop pointing stop finger. the finger at everybody. We know something's going on, and we can get to the bottom of it if we keep our heads. I know what we found. I know, Lily. I know. Nobody was stealing anything! Was it both of you? What? I've seen you two together. Was it both of you? Look, just let me out. I didn't do it, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. Lily, lay off of him. I... Shit! What's going on up there? I, I hit something. something. We gotta stop. Alright, well, we can deal with this now then. Kitty, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily? Out. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. I'm not gonna take this. You can push Ben around, but you can't push me around. I'm really sorry you feel that 
No, somebody else. Start thinking maybe it was both of them. No, I'm not, not doing this. this. Come on, you're the one who found them. You can't just abstain. Fuck all that. This is nuts. Us. We're out I'm here on, on the side, side of the road. road. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Huh. The hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. Do you think any of that is good now? He's broken, Lily. I can see that. Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this. Shut up, Harley. I've heard enough out of you. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Then? You have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you. Stop this. You're torturing him. No. Stop. This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. I did it. What? Yeah, it was me. That gets you to lay off the kid? I think you're capable of being a real piece of shit. But I know it wasn't you. Not with her in your life. I got these. Let's just get back. That's not what happened. You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can hurt you. But you're just a scared little girl. Get the fuck over it. Take a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. Now, what the fuck's the problem? Oh. Drop it. Oh, fuck. Kenny, what's Kenny, happening? Keep Duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I swear. Please. You are not coming with us. You are not coming with us. I'll die out here. I don't care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. I don't care what he did before. You know? Yeah, he told me. I don't give a shit. If we keep you with us, how long until you get me? I was trying to protect all of us. I don't have anything left. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. She crazy, man. Lee, a word, please. You okay? Katya needs you for something. We need to speak to you up here. What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? He got bit. What the fuck? Happened during the raid. What's the plan? What's the plan? We've never had a bite victim in the group before. I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Important to stay honest with each other. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. So this is the part I saw on the second one. Duck is bit. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. 
I'll just go ahead and say it. Feel good. What about Carly? Go on, we won't go back. We can't go back. Because she was shot in the head. That's right. It's horrible. She saw too much, man. yelling and trying to get into my house he wanted to take the TV and tried to break the glass door with a rock then some walkers came and scared him away the door was open he was dumb that means there is water He fell asleep. Get off of me. <sighs> we got something up ahead. It's a home. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clint, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, huh? Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. Okay, let's open this. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so, but this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. Take this to catch him for Doc. Let me go back in here. Go over here. I think it's this way, ain't it?
Yep, it's this way. There's gonna be a better way to do this. Get out on this side. thinking about like somehow that matters it doesn't i know well i don't but you're probably right let me talk to the rest of these people we found this in the box car back there whoa is this what it looks like <laughs> i think so these tracks lead right to savannah can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on. Hey, sweet pea, you okay out here? I don't think Doc feels good. Me neither. You stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys are dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. Mm -hmm. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay then. Okay then. Alright guys, I'm about to end it here. I've been doing this for like an hour or so. So yeah, I'm about to do the other one right after this anyway. You know, like the video if you want more of this, and then subscribe. Follow me on all the stuff I said on the last video. That's a lot of stuff to do for an ending. So, yeah. So, yeah. That was signing off, y'all. Peace.